Hi there, it's Lynn Bead Fairy One here. It's been a little while since I've done a video. Yeah, I've been uh, busy catching up with some Christmas bits. I just wanted to do you a quick video on some of the bits that I've been doing as uh, Christmas presents, and um, I had some of these larger um, uh, MDF tiles, and um, I thought they would make good coasters. So um, I've made some as gifts um, for. A daughter and my daughter and some friends and another daughter so um this is one set that i've done um this this daughter is into um sewing and um i've done sort of like a sewing she loves purple and butterflies and things like that so um the light's not very good because it's night time here so i hope you can see this Right, this one's got like a heart with wings and some um, scroll work and you see underneath um, you can still see the pattern from underneath as well and I've used um, I think it's three colours warm lipstick Victorian velvet and um, what was the other one dusty concord so it's that one and then this one Um, I've used loads of different stamps and word stamps and bits and pieces and this one had like a lace um, stamp underneath um, this one sorry I, I've just got to get these done and wrapped um, butterflies with um, scroll detail work underneath and what have you and then this one is a corset and all sorts of sewing stuff and um, I've done them with glossy accents I did try using um, the UT but I find when I use the UT that the, um, the colours fade I'll show you what I mean in a minute right, these ones were like um, uh, what do you call them? corsage stamps corsage stamps and um, What I done was just stamp it, and I, I sort of watercolored it with um, the distress stains rather than uh, bobbing it. And that one, this one, the um, glossy accent went all bubbly for some reason. I don't know why. It was an old bottle, I think, and um, that's another one. I think these were by Creative Expressions. These stamp. This one's gone. You see that very bubbly and I put um like um oh what do they call them H2O's on her wings and sort of gold on the on the word some of the words and so those ones and then these ones I haven't quite finished I haven't glossy accented them because I started I'm just gonna change hands I started um using the UT and I don't know if you can see the difference right this one against this is how it would have started hang on let's see if I can hold them up together can you see how much that is like faded the colour and that is the UT and if you in the background it's sort of gone all it's as if I've not heated it enough or heated it too much if anybody knows why it's gone like that can you let me know because you know keep using glossy accents all the time it's rather expensive so this is the other set that I've done I haven't finished um, doing them yet so it's that one and then that one so that's it for now and um, I'll be back um, after Christmas bye for now bye